Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I am going to explain about the portal customization. And this video is the continuation series of Pega Portal Customization Part 3. If you don't watch that series, please watch it first and come to this video. Why? Because you can't understand anything what I am teaching in this video. In the previous video, I discussed about the what is the importance of harness and what is the use of harness. And I also customized the header area. That is, the I take the red bus portal as a demo purpose. I am practically implementing this portal in our Pega portal. Actually, it's not a portal. It's like a web mashup. And I'm implementing in the way of portal in the Pega. So I configured the header area. That is, I done this logo and account and all. So the result is here. So this is the portal I customized in the Pega. So my second task is about I have to customize this main area that is the content area I have to customize. Let's go to the section again. Go to Dev Studio and this is my header area I already customized and I want to customize this main content. Just double click on it. And it will open a section. And I have to customize this area like this. Okay. Uh, first of all, I want this background uh, background picture. How will you get means? Just right click on this web mashup and inspect. And you have to inspect the background. Just go to this background. And here you can find the link. And just click on this link. and copy image url or you can open the image in the new tab so the image will be there for you you can screenshot or you can download or you can copy the url and you can download by using any app you can get the picture so i screenshot this image and i have to import in my pega you just go to technical binary file and I have to import create the name is background image red bus background and directory is webwb and the formatting is png create and open and upload choose your file and here is my file just open and click on upload and click on save it will show you the preview of the image just copy this link and go to this content that is home main section 2 you have to set this dynamic layout background so how will you set this dynamic layout background is there any option you can set yeah there is a option you can customize the skin rule that is dynamic layout and change the background and just double click on this if you want to change the background of the dynamic layout, you should change the container format. I may click on default and click on submit. So the background is changing. Same as if you go to the skin rule, the application menu and go to the containers here and go to inherit, you have to change the default by clicking on save as you have to save as the rule you should not override why because if you override any rule the out of the box all the default rules will be changes so that's why you have to save as the rule and you have to modify as your requirement and i'm giving the name as bus bg and submit 
I have to change the background that is the box and go to the background specific style I have to add the image here okay background color and the location of the image is I have to copy this link and paste here Ash. Hot P. and if you want to see your picture just click on the settings icon there you can find your picture and the path and the size also and make sure your position is center center only and click on save just go back to your section that is home main 2 it's our main content area I have to call a dynamic layout here just double click on this dynamic layout and go to container format other just drop down plus bg click on submit and click on save and just close our portal and open again so here the picture is not visible why because the dynamic layout is very small you have to expand the dynamic layout how can you expand just call the multiple dynamic layouts in the on dynamic layout dynamic layout and paste it below paste it below paste it below paste it below so by using this expansion of dynamic layout you can clearly show your picture okay I think the size is okay and just click on save it's like padding in your HTML uh, okay and just close your portal and reopen again so here you can find the background of the main content area like the red bus portal okay as like it in the mega portal so we have to add this label and we have to add this from to i think we have to write the html code uh, to get these type of sizes uh, here i'm only using the drop down and i i try to customize the skin rule drop downs to get these sizes if not possible you have to write the html to get these type of shape and first of all i have to implement the label first uh, just go to our section and I have to call a dynamic layout here that is here and call a dynamic layout first I have to put this dynamic layout inline grip triple why because the label in center okay just click on submit and data display call the label and copy drop down and drop down under label you have to write the text in the center label so I'm copying the text here and paste here and you should change the presentation to heading 1 I think heading one is also not possible to get that big big text so let me try and save and close your portal and go to your portal again here you can find I think it's look it does not look like this you have to increase the size okay I try to I try to increase the size by customizing the skin rule and we have to disable these labels I am using visibility condition here just double click on these labels 
and when <clears throat> and reserve space for it and the condition is never submit and go to this again do the same process and when and never reserve space for the hide and touch and save then close your portal go again then you can find but I want this size uh, let me see the size inspect I think the size is font size is 32 pixels and the style is normal and the weight is 700 I want the weight that is 700 okay and I should go to my dev studio and open the skin rule again try to update the heading one the heading one is under let me see it's under the presentation it's under the label format just go to the label format in your skin rule where it is yeah labels and required fields just go to inherit and go to heading one and I'm customizing this rule customizing means I want to save as this heading one rule click on save as and I'm giving here is bus label and click on submit and the rule is created for our requirement and just go to your required fields or uh, mixes background styles and add styles you have to use the heading use specific style okay there you can find the font size is 22 pixels and the here the font is about 32 pixels I have to put the 32 pixels here and the font color is about uh, let me see the font color and RGB 000, 000. and I have to put the font color is RGB where is it RGB 000, 000. that is pure black okay let me save and the weight is what's the weightage here weight is 700 Okay, let's go to change the weight that is 700 and the text declaration there is no text declaration and text uh, okay justification it's uh, justify no I think it's left only uh, click on save I think this configuration is suitable for those to get this type of label let me let me call the bus label in the section just go to the home main to and remove this top down and there you can find bus label and click on submit okay just click on save and close the portal and open the portal again So this is our output and in the real portal the sentence is in a single line in our portal this is in a double line we have to customize this just go to the section again and remove these labels and just set the dynamic layout to default and submit then you can save and reopen the portal again here the sentence it should be in the center just go to dev studio and set this dynamic layout to inline grid middle inline middle and click on submit and you should call a label here 
data display label and here I'm giving the label name is yes all yes 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 30 and the presentation is heading why because I want to set the heading in the center that's why I'm giving these labels and go to this condition we will be reserve space for it and condition is never and click on submit and save just reopen the portal again and we got it it's our red bus real portal it's our customized portal okay and that's all for this video guys if you have any doubts please comment below and i will do so many videos on this pega very interesting topics please give me one like uh, so many people are asking me about why you can't doing any videos and can't uploading any videos uh, in the channel the reason is I'm getting the views but I'm don't getting any likes uh, if you like my content if you uh, want my content very useful to your purpose and give me one like guys it's very encouraging and motivating to me uh, please comment your experience and thank you bye bye